Everyone knows the classic, The Wizard of Oz, which was first released as a movie in the year 1939. In 1989, the movie was released for its 50th anniversary in VHS. If you happen to find this original VHS tape, or you already own it, then you may already be familiar with a particular scene which had a lot of controversy. In the scene where Dorothy, the Tin Man and the Scarecrow begin walking along the yellow brick road after surpassing a wood cabin. In the back, by the trees, there is a small figure that appears to be hanging. The few people who have noticed this all came to the assumption that it was a munchkin who is hanging from one of the branches on the tree. Everyone was told time after time that it was simply a bird because they had filmed it at a zoo and it made it seem more natural. Warner Brothers released the film in 1998, where they restored and remastered it all. This is a tape that is mostly commonly found and is what played on television. In this version, since it is a lot clearer, you can clearly see that it is in fact a bird in that scene. However, if you manage to find a clip of the original and play the two scenes right next to each other, it is very clear that something is off. The bird in the renewed version is not in the exact same place as the bird in the original. Also, if you look closely, you can see that in the original there is some kind of rope connected to one of the branches. And yet, after the 1998 version overpowered the original in popularity, people completely decided that it was in fact a bird, not even glimpsing at the very original. Of course it is possible that it was a bird, it's just as possible that there was in fact a hanging munchkin. People have said that those trays are much smaller than they appear, and that they would not something like that slip up in a movie. But munchkins were small, and so it is very possible that a munchkin or rather one of the actors playing a munchkin had hanged himself. Also, there have been many movies which have let things like that slip, such as The Ghost and Three Men and a Baby. That ghost was actually a poster someone accidentally left there, and even though it was clearly seen, it was left in the film. Not to mention that there were many rumours of the Munchkin actors being treated very badly on set, which could have driven one of them to do this. Another hanging Munchkin rumour is that the Munchkin had lost his love and was so devastated that he took his life. Whether or not you believe in the hanging Munchkin, it is something that brings the whole movie down into a darker light than what it is usually portrayed as. Goes to show, not everything is as it seems, and even the brightest of things have hidden darkness. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. You can also leave a comment below. All feedback, good, or otherwise is always appreciated. If you have any creepy stories of your own or have any topics that you would like me to cover, feel free to send them in via any of my social media. You can find all links to my social media in the description below. Until next time guys, make sure you lock your doors, stay safe and I'll see you next video.